Hi all, welcome back to our channel. In this video, it helps you to manage sponsors and attendees for an event in Odoo 15. It is necessary to activate options in the settings menu before managing the sponsors and attendees. We can select the settings menu in the configuration tab and then we can activate the option of online exhibitors to the visible sponsor icon in the events window. Enabling this option in the settings window assists in accessing registration, attendance and events. Then we can select the created event from this dashboard of events module. And here in this window, we can see basic details like venue, date, time zone, template, responsible person and the tags. And below the invite icon, we can see some of the smart tabs like attendees, registration desk, booth, tracks, sponsors, rooms and go to website. The event stages are shown at the right end of the window. In addition, the limit registration option helps you to add the highest number of attendees limit for your event. And we can invite more participants using the invite icon and the contact attendees. We can click on the attendees options in the events window and we will direct to a new page. Here we can see the attendees list taking part in the event. Here in this list view, we can see some of the details like registration date, attendee name, email, phone, event ticket status. It is also possible to add custom fields like registration date, book by, sales order, company, etc. In the calendar view, we can generate a meeting at a specific date for attendees. And then we can uh, search the events or meetings in a day, week, monthly and yearly format. The graph view of the attendees window shows the events at the x-axis and the count on the y-axis. And we can view the graph in bar, bar chart, line chart in the, and also in the pie chart. It is also possible to sort according to the descending and ascending view. And then we can choose various customizable features like filters, group by and the favorites. Finally, here in the cohort view, you can see the count date, uh, registration date of, of an event. So the average count of the attendees is displayed here. Now we can click on the specific date. The information regarding attendees is visible before you. The create icon in the attendees window assists in developing new participant details of an event. So here we can enter the details of the attendee or event information. So you can choose a book by person from this drop down menu. So the attendees name, email, phone number will be auto allocated here. After that we can enter the name and ticket of an event under the event information. Then you can see a question tab at the bottom of the window and it helps to create question for an attendee. So the question tab contains details like suggested answer, question, text answer and tag. So we can click on the confirm and save button after typing the details of the attendee. Here you can see the option to discard the registration using the cancel registration icon. So the stages of an attendee window arranges in unconfirmed, confirmed and attended. So here we can view the created attendee details in the attendees window. Now we can select the event from the events dashboard and we can view the sponsors option in the events window. So click on that and a page of event sponsors is available before you. The details of the sponsors are visible here in the campaign view. In the list view, we can see the vast information regarding each sponsor separately. It includes name, partner, sponsor email, website, sponsor level is published and the sponsor type. And here we have the option to add custom field. So we can click on the create icon to develop a new sponsor and enter the sponsor details in this window. So here in this window, we can add the name of the sponsor. And here we can provide the slogan for that. We 
Plato, we can choose the partner from the drop down menu. So, the email, phone, website will be auto allocated. Then, we can choose the event from this drop down menu by clicking on the external link and see the details of the event. Then, we can choose the sponsoring level as gold, silver, and bronze. Then, we can choose the sponsor type as sponsor, exhibitor, and online exhibitor. After that, we can press on the save icon to store the attendees details. Here inside the send message tab, we can see the option to send messages and attachments for the followers of a sponsor. And then click on the send button to reach a large audience. In the log note, you can add internal messages and attachments. After that, press on the log icon. And then we can organize an activity by clicking on the schedule activity icon. In the schedule activity window, we can enter the activity type, assigned person, summary and the due date. And press on the schedule icon. So the details of a created sponsor are visible in the event sponsors window and we can view the number of sponsors in the events window. So the Odo 15 events module contains several features such as forming, forming events, inviting attendees registration and templates for an event. So we can manage the sponsors, attendees and events tracking using the events module. Apart from this, the event module combined with the website sales and marketing modules of the Odo platform and the organization can maintain smooth coordination of an event using the Odo 15 events module. That's all about the video. Thank you for watching.